Mark Brown is the fucking brightest motherfucker that ever came to this plane. You yep, I mean? yep. We all wouldn't be here talking some sense. King of hell, Mark Brown. Appreciate everything from everyone. I'm just a girl on the Babylon. Michael told us in the flesh. It's like the jet fuel hoax. They're running the planes on. Everything's a hoax. Yeah, just like the uh, nuclear plants. They're making fake gold out of the nuclear plants. They say they're getting diamonds from the firmament, that the diamonds are actually... They're going to the edge of the earth, and they're bringing back pieces of glass. Some kind of firmament glass. Is that where diamonds are coming from? I don't know. I can't verify that either. That's a yeah. Could be. But you just see that everything's a lie. Like, they've lied to us about everything. Yep. So, yep. You just, I got a great big, huge Navy file. <laughs> see, this is a center of the earth. Oh, shit. The North Pole. That's the blood red stem cell rich waters we want to be drinking. Uh, should have been the first thing they taught us, the Holy Grail. You go there once a year, drink the living waters. It's said to be in May, there's something connected to May Day, that we've got to go down the Maypole with the May Sun. That's why they dance around the Maypole, they know it's a, you know, a spiritual place to dance around. They're all rubbing it in our face, they know. Yeah, we were looking at those last night, the Maypoles. They're dancing. The Mother of menstrual blood. It's blood red, stem cell rich, menstrual blood. You dive into this red blood, you drink it, you bathe in it. And it has the stem cells of youth. That's why they're using blood from children to reverse aging, because it has the youthfulness in it. Mm -hmm. Which is the wrong way to be murdering children. The harvest them for their adrenochrome is it's evil. Blood magic. Yeah, it's... What else, what else is it? It's evil. Mm -hmm. But we reversed so you're it. In hell. They're feeding your own children back to you. Turning into hey, hey. cannibals. H-E-K-293, aborted baby fetuses in the food flavoring. Turning everybody hey, into hey. cannibal. It's in all kinds of popular name brand foods. McDonald's? Yep. That's not uh, baby. K they got baby blood and horse three. meat. Horse meat in the McDonald's food. All these gummy yeah. candies and food flavorings and all the like soft drinks and common drinks that we've all had. Yeah. Every should have been drinking store from the phone selling the protein, protein bars. I mean, they're putting aspartame in the children's candy. Aspartame has like 80 or 90 known neurotoxin side effects. Hey, what that you say that code was? You said H-E-K what? H-E-K-293. It is a food flavoring that is said to be derived from the kidney cells of aborted baby fetuses. So... I heard about that, yeah. You know, verify that one for yourself. But I think the Planned Parenthood has... Something different. Something different. Something different. Something different. Something Yeah. Planned Parenthood. Children's Aid and the Protective Services are the ones that are targeting families and kidnapping your children. And they get paid to do it. They're making money. Imagine if you gave the money that these people got to the families that are having trouble. Because yeah. they can't afford their bills, so they're fighting over money and then they just break some Yeah, Mike, you're absolutely right. That shit's in everything. <laughs> yeah, it's disturbing when you see, like, is that real? I don't know. I can't bear no, it. It's real. It's, it's, aborted. Mile, it's aborted fetus cells. Mainly used from the uh, embroidered and kidney cells. Yep. From the fetuses. Mm -hmm. I've learned about this one quite some time ago. This came up in the research. That's a ton of shit. That's sick. I mean, Abe Finkelstein told you that McDonald's is serving you your own children's meat back to you. They told you that they told yeah. you. Look yeah. up Abe. Yeah, the Jews told you. They came right on they the radio told and told you. They did, and you did. He went right on the radio in New York and told everybody. <laughs> that. I used to work for a franchise at McDonald's. 
Yeah, franchise? Hey, Mike. Yeah. Like, um, it's called Cinomix. That's what it is. S S E N O M Y X. And that's, yeah. that's the word for H E K 293. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've heard that term before. Yeah. What is I that? What is it? It's Cinomix. Cinomix. Food made to spell with a with a Y though. Apparently, it's addictive. Really? And it's turning everybody into cannibals. Hmm. I don't know if it's addictive or not. I don't know if it's real or not. How do you how do you verify this? How do you determine it? Yeah. How do you know that it's kidney cells of a, of aborted fetuses hmm. since 1973? It's Cinomax. Know, it's back here. It's Cinomax. Bunch of heathens. Crazy. Necrophiliacs just getting drunk and fucking making unwanted pregnancies. And yep. Sickos, man. It's just man. a murder, murder-based industry. Yep. Land of the dead. You're yep. in a cult of death already, and you don't have to like it. You probably shouldn't. Land of the dead. So whatever is in the mainstream media, like for example, like fucking celebrities pushing, uh, oh yeah, I drink Gatorade, right? Right, Gatorade. Yeah. I yeah, Gatorade. It's on the list. Gatorade is on the list. Gatorade. I drink Gatorade. Yeah, Yo, you guys Gatorade check blues. this out, right? Um, all the Pepsi drinks, Sierra Mist drinks, Mountain Dew drinks, Mug Root beers, all the sodas. Um, all the Ocean Spray, Seattle Best Coffee, Stazos, Energy Beverages, Aquafina Water, Aquafina Flavors, Double Shot Energy Beverages, Frappuccino from Duncan, Lipton Tea, Propel Beverages, Sobe Beverages, Gatorade really? Beverages, all of them. Everybody's um, had one of these Tropicana's. Sounds like... <laughs> What's in all those drinks yeah. you were just naming out, Kane? He said what? All those drinks I drink you, coffee. you were just naming off all those drinks, but you didn't say what was in them. I'm about to put the list. I'm about to put the whole list in. Oh, chat. just for the video purpose, though. So what, what's in all those drinks? Um, it's Cinomix. Oh, the same shit uh, we were talking about. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's Cinomix. It's basically that. Uh, it's what Mike said, the HK. Damn, I just lost the name. It's H E K. Two, nine, yeah. So what is H E K two nine? Hey Google. Is what is Cinemix H E K two nine three? According to Wikipedia, H E K two hundred ninety three cells are a cell line widely used in biological and medical research, immortalized through a genetic modification removed from the original human embryonic kidney cells taken from a healthy, aborted human fetus in the early nineteen seventies. So that's yeah, in all the food, breeding. all the drinks. Genetically modified to have the nutrients engineered out of it, so you never really get fucking uh, food, and you're still hungry. Coffee you're sweeteners, coffee sweeteners. They have that shit in them, I think. Oh yeah. Yeah. They'll, they're gonna make them. sure you're drinking that shit. Wow. This goes beyond measure, bro. You know, like they're fluoridating the water to. They say that the type of fluoride they use is specifically engineered to ta- attack your pineal gland. Yep. How do you verify this? But they're adding fluoride to the water. They're adding chlorine to the water. So much fluoride, bro. Like I was gonna, go, I was talking about beer earlier and like what they don't tell you what's in it. But think about how much fluoride's in that shit, dude. Like Budweiser. Like that shit's got so much fluoride in it. It's insane. Plus, they're in an aluminum can, so you're consuming aluminum. Yeah, they don't tell you what's in it. Causes all shit. kinds of disease. People all can get mad sick drinking it. Aluminum here. flows magnetic fields down. Fucking poison everybody in that shit. Yeah, I dropped the link in the chat there. Cool, bro. Yeah, I mean, you know, yeah, it's all out there. Some of the AJ information, you know. But I appreciate it. You know, we all drop. Uh, good information with each other we all it's like it helps because it's not only is my research like what i dig up you know other people are digging up other stuff as well so it, it just comes helpful when we all just provide all the information we dig up and tell each other and the important the important thing is that mm-hmm. you know we need to live 
for yeah. this cause. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Is, but all this information like, we've been taking yeah. in already has been awesome, dude. Like all the communications, plus we're sharing the chats. Everybody can eat what we're saying, they're hearing, you know, and, and they can catch on to it too. Like we're not hiding our intent. We're here to yeah, try to get more people to catch on to this. We're doing this freely from the comfort of our own homes, you know, and, and we're trying to get other people to see this, that they can do this. It's not going to harm you in any way, shape or form. You're going to bring forth heaven from the comfort of your own home and claim your divinity back and you know it's the most powerful thing you know it's like getting your own power back that's literally the most like like biggest thing you could do with your own life is getting your power back getting to the center of the flat earth to drink from the living waters before you die that's your mission yeah you stand fail. the truth obviously you are not standing the truth for now because game over you know it's back it's to the moon matrix reincarnation the false light trap you'll get caught like a tractor beam you'll hold <coughs> in said that the magnetic residue on your soul from the iron in your blood it, like it locks onto you magnetically like a tractor beam they're showing you the death star is the moon in star wars yeah and it's reincarnating you you get caught in this in square wave it's poisoning the well and it will Invert you somehow, it, it flips you and it reinserts you with your memories erased. Hmm. Your soul memories are wiped and you come back. Michael, yeah. Or knowing nothing. That's why children don't know anything. They're born, you have to teach them everything. Ma, 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 da, da, da. You gotta teach them the phonetics of the language that you speak. Whether it's Preach English it, or Preach Spanish it. or whatever you know, fragmentation of communication you're using, whichever language. Your tongue is a rudder, and every word you speak is a magic spell. It's what you said, God is a name never to be spoken. It's it's like, it's pretty yeah. It's magnetics and electrics, and we're birthed into it. Your thoughts are electric, and your emotions are magnetic. Damn. Preach it, bro. That was good. Yeah, that's, we're in it. You're stuck to your 666 carbon cell. You got in the door. Bio photons. You got the genetic code from your, your parents. Why you look like your mom and your dad? You got your mom's eyes and your dad's nose or whatever. You got the facial features. You kind of look like your old man because you got the genetic code from his balls. Like you're made from him. He gave you the genetic code for you to have a body. <laughs> and your mother gave you, you know, the, the the womb. You got the genetic code from your parents and your bio photons. You know, fused. Your soul got in the door through the vesica Pisces there when the sperm and the egg united in holy matrimony. You got your body. It took nine months. And then you're inside an amniotic sac. You're not even breathing air when you're inside the womb of your mother. You're breathing in liquids until the sac ruptures and then you're birthed into here. And now, you know, you had an umbilical cord. They cut it from your stomach. There's a hole in Whoa, your belly. That's crazy. That's where all the nutrients came from, and their placenta was fused to the wall of your mother's uterus, and you got all the nutrients came through the cord, and now you have a silver cord at the top of your head, and we have bodies above the war water, and you're etherically connected to it. One of these stars outside the firmament is your body. You have to get there before you die. This is what I understand. You need to be birthed out of here. That's why the yes, Christians sir. are always, yes, sir. You're always talking about right. being born again. Born again Christians. We need to be born again. Like you need to like consciously hike yourself to the North Pole and you need to be born yeah. again. You gotta yeah. go through a birthing canal. You literally need to be actually born again. That's why there's gonna be thrashing and screaming. Like, yep. who's prepared to dive into a hole at the center of the earth for real? Mm -hmm. To actually be birthed out of here. Yeah, I mean, nobody's prepared. really prepared, but were we prepared to come in here to this place? I don't think anybody was prepared to come into this, into this place, you know? And especially to come into, you know, the way, the fashion we did, you know? But it's like Mark said, you know, we came into this place kicking and screaming. It's just going to be like that when we yeah. leave, you know? Kicking and screaming. We're going we're gonna to be like, what the fuck? Like, we're going to be birthed into a whole new dimension, you know? With a whole... have to be born again literally actually have to be born again you can't just believe somebody else died for your sins that somebody right. else put up blood for for you that's going to save your soul i mean we're put 
we're kind of the ones putting up blood trying to save other people's souls but in order to join us in the book of life you have to put your own spiritual currency into it you're right they would never want to stand in truth 